Hello everyone, today I'm making a build for the Lockwood 300, also known as the 725. This is a really disgusting shotgun. If you build it properly, you can make it do some disgusting things. I tested it with slugs, explosive rounds, buckshot, and the dragon's breath. I have tuned this weapon for damage range for buckshot. Bullet velocity matters less on buckshot because you're going to be closer to your target. There's not a whole lot of distance between you, so your pellets don't have to travel as far. I made a short about a week ago telling people that they should be aiming more often with shotguns. You can check out that video here at the top right here to find out why. One last thing before we get into gameplay and I'll stop talking your ear off. People get really pissed off when you use shotguns in this game. It's really entertaining. So the previous game that I showed was a test to make sure that my audio recording was working. However, that part at the end just cracked me up. And we lost because I had two teammates rage quit in the middle of the match. So. Plus, it was a bunch of people using the marksman rifles in the game, so that was, you know. But I'll see you when we get in the next match. Okay. So we're on LSCO, where it's already 5v fucking 5, because they didn't fill the teams. What do you mean coming, eh? Oh, okay. This is why I don't like marksman rifles. Right here. No flinch, by the way. Do you notice that? What the fuck? Obviously, it come from that way. Can't see because tack mask doesn't work properly. And that streak real quick. Oh, all right. Gotta reload. Think of a teammate killed. Behind the door, by the way, and have fly jacket. It feels like fly jacket only absorbs like one explosive in this game, and tag mask is, doesn't do what it says it is. It says it reduces the effects, but I still get fully blinded, even when the flash lands behind me. I see you. Where are you going? Go this way. Copium. Oh, he's above me. Fuck you. I think he's cursing at me in Spanish.
by the time this video comes out, there should be a video that came up previously before this one talking about the DMZ info that we just got yesterday. So if you want to see more DMZ and Call of Duty content, consider liking and subscribing, and have a wonderful day, everybody.